didn't! <laughs> you broke It's working fine! So we're about to go pick up a Fiat Punto for £150. <laughs> Which is insane for any car. Yes, for, I mean, even just for the scrap metal of it, it's a pretty good price, especially in this economy. Yeah, and it does run. It so does run, it actually runs and drives. Currently, the reason why we're looking for any kind of vehicle within this kind of budget mm -hmm. is because my daily, yes. unfortunately, is broken down. Yeah. And while I work on that and fix it, I need a temporary daily driver, and we stumbled across this uh, Fiat Punto for 800 quid. Yes, yeah, so it was listed for £800. I'll show the listing somewhere here. <laughs> yeah, so listed for £800. We went to look at it the other day, and you were actually kind of prepared to pay probably around that mark because it looked really clean. Uh, yeah, yeah. It was like 40,000 miles on the it clock. It says 44,000, I think. 44,000 on the clock. Yes. <laughs> and um, yeah, like, it, you know, it seemed like a pretty good buy. Uh, we turned up and um, on the way there, we figured out that it had mileage fraud. Looking at the MOT, it did five miles in, a, in about five years. Yeah, it did about one mile a year for quite a while. <laughs> we turn up and we look around. Bodywork looks all good. Quite yeah. happy with that. Started first time, oil fine. Yeah, and, th and then what happened? You? you had to put your foot on the clutch. <laughs> uh, there just wasn't a clutch. Because then we, we drove like what, like for like thirty seconds, and then you were like, "This is really bad." And I was like, "Okay, let me try it out. Let me see." I was like, this is terrible. Yeah. The clutch is terrible. I was like, okay, Matt wasn't exaggerating. So, uh, yeah. What did we do? We said, no, we, we don't want it. Yeah. And then what did she do? She said, would you take anything for it, please? I'm <laughs> trying to get rid of it. Yeah, she then proceeded to say that they actually got an offer from We Buy Any Car for £100. Yeah. So on the way back, me and Matt were going, shouldn't buy it. We, we, we really shouldn't buy it. No. Um, <laughs> but then ideas started flowing around our heads yeah. of future content to do with this car. So, long story short, we offered 150 quid yeah. and she said yes. You join me in the 150 pound Fiat Punto. Now this car was made in 2004 and it came with a mighty 60 brake horsepower. <laughs> and you know what that means? This car is rapid. 0 to 60, 14 seconds. Whoa! Now the features that this car comes with, Porsche would only dream of having this in their car. It has electric windows. We've got a radio player that doesn't sit in the radio holder. It is just hanging out. Porsche only dreams of doing something like that. Oh yes, look at here, the mighty engine. Uh, it's got no clutch. I mean, who doesn't want to drive a car without a clutch? And unlike with a lot of Fiat's, you've got the city steering mode button, which if I demonstrate now, Look at this! Whoa! <laughs> I'm speeding up. Oh, let's see how it goes around the roundabout. Oh, fuck me! <laughs> I don't think it's actually that bad of a car for 150 quid. For 1200 quid, absolutely. 150. I think we've got an okay car. Now the plan for this is. Um, the next video, we're going to camp in it, me and Harry. Uh, we're going to camp on a budget. <laughs> See, yeah, I tried sleeping this for a night. I thought it might be a bit of fun. Uh, and then I think from then on, well, we're going to turn into a track car. Uh, we're going to fill it with a bunch of like, AliExpress and Timu parts and <laughs> have some fun with it. Oh, that should be quite a lot of fun. <laughs> I'm actually quite enjoying this car, even though it's this shit. After some more driving, Matt then really started to get into character as a young Punto driver. I am 18. Also, everyone's jealous of me because I've got a car. My Fiat Punto. The 1.2 Fiat Punto. Surprisingly, slower than a Vauxhall EcoFlex. Just thought you had to know. Anyway. No, my whips, my whips very fast. 0 to 60 in 
quick time. Everyone seems to be flashing me. Why is everyone flashing me? Am I doing something wrong? I fu my fuck lights are on. No! <laughs> I thought I turned them off! You enjoying it? Yes. Yeah? Y yes. <laughs> as much She's as I can. <laughs> right. She feels like a Ferrari. Yeah? An Italian stallion. Yeah. This thing. That's a radio. Just, yeah. <laughs> a radio. Oh, I can my radio! <laughs> Yeah, there you go. That's it's not it's not on now. Max volume. It sounds Russian. We picked up a Russian radio. I want to feel that's not it. in English. Yeah, it is. What does it say? Sinwi Sinwi. Sinwi. That's not English. <laughs> the radio clearly had a language. Stroke. Oh, there you go. Oh. English. <laughs> Did <it> take the whole. <laughs> take it up. There's shit. Get <laughs> <laughs> it up. Oh god, no, oh, no, don't take, take it the out. whole thing out! What oh, have no. done? The, the, <laughs> it just broke it on radio! <laughs> hang on, hang on. <laughs> don't! How does Leave that it get alone, in? leave my beauty alone. <laughs> Plastic trimming, there you go. No, I've just got Bloody the radio. Bloody you don't respect it's like an iPod. classics. I do. This no. is this is not a classic. This, this is an is aftermarket. A, this radio. will be a, no. This car will be a classic, and you just be in the shit out of it. Oh, this really works. <laughs> you broke it. No, I didn't. <laughs> you broke it. It's working fine. No, Harry, that's my foot down. I was going twenty, and that was my foot down. Really? Yeah. Oh shit! Like all the way, like yeah. slammed on the brakes. Okay, that's not great. No. So you ready? I'm doing 30 miles an hour, viewers. Yeah. Let me break. Emergency, stop! I said stop! <laughs> We're still going! Stop! <laughs> there you go, that's a stop. Okay. So, so we went 200 feet. <laughs> Although this may the look Porsche, like and drive feature. like a Porsche. And sounds like a Porsche, really. I prefer the original Porsche. This is a poor man Porsche. I mean, this That's is a poor point. man's fear. <laughs> <laughs> this is just poor. <laughs> but you've got an aftermarket radio system. It's almost as good as your Audi. <laughs> pretty much. Yeah, my Audi's pretty... Oh, well, it's better than my Audi, because it runs. Yeah, For context, sorry. viewers, my uh, Audi, to get... So one of the speakers worked, the other one doesn't. Uh, that yeah. blew up on the M4 and deafened me for about a couple of hours. But... It does work now because I found out if you smack the door with your hand, just really hard, just very hard, it like like beat the car up, like you, like you're being your your wife. Um, let's 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 cut that out. Uh, <laughs> if you smack the door extremely hard, uh, <laughs> like your wife, you will, <laughs> you will uh, get some sound out of that speaker. Oh, I introduce you to the lineup of cars. We've got the Porsche. The Mini, the 86, the Fiat Punto, and Matt's broken Audi. <laughs> Why'd you have to highlight that your car's broken too? Yeah. That car. No, nope, no it's not. And that one. No, nope, it's fine. They're both and fine. the Porsche well, actually. Right. <laughs> anyway, The so. only one that's not broken is the Fiat. The Fiat is our most reliable car, which we just bought for £150. Anyway, what are we thinking of the car so far? Are we happy with our purchase? Generally? I'm actually quite happy with it. I'm really happy with it. I'm 150 pounds, you can't go wrong. 150 pounds, I mean, that's worth more than 150 pounds in scrap. Yeah. So. Are you prepared to sleep in it next week? Um, we'll have to sleep next to you. You will, yeah, and I'll be snoring. And plus, because you're and smaller, no, you're going to have to go on the side of the pedals. Anyway, right, let's have a look <laughs> around this car. So, Matt, take us through to... from the front. Welcome to my new whip, Fiat <sighs> Italian. Now yeah, you've got something called a, a wiper, a window wiper, Fiat Punto Active. Yeah. Which I don't know what that means, but maybe it means it's healthy. Yeah. Uh, than the it, normal. I'm sure that's exactly what it means. So aerial. Walk us through. What's the bodywork? Like? Right. I, mean, body I think it looks pretty good. I mean, there's a few scuffs. For twenty, how long? How old is it now? Twenty three oh, years old. This. It's not bad that I can't, obviously, yeah, the front is, I think that's just dirt, you know. There's a little bit of, 
scuff in, but nothing you know, yeah, I yeah. wouldn't care about for 150 quid. But like, it's, it's in pretty good nick overall. I mean, okay, this bit of plastic could probably go back in the car. Got a bit of paint peel on the back. Nothing too but major. Like, nothing too bad, really. Um, the wheels, <laughs> not actually scuffed. Compare them to the TT wheels. <laughs> that's an Audi. <laughs> this is a and that's a Fiat. Fiat. Audi. Fiat. <laughs> Let's show him the Animals engine bit. We have. Oh yeah, let's, let's see this end. beast of an engine. You're going to see what we mean when we say there's a lot of room in this thing. Oh, look at that! You could almost fit a child in there. I don't know why you'd want to, but yeah, you could, I guess. Let's say your your family, right? Yeah. In Britain, yeah. you've got three kids. Three kids, okay. Wait, one of them's a bit fat, so they, they take up two seats. in the back. Well, yeah. you don't need to worry. Chuck a child in here. Yeah. Give me an extra 15 horsepower. Wow, they could do some running. They'll lose weight and you'll get better fuel economy. I mean, isn't that the the dream? Wow, that, right. that is the dream. That, if you, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the dream. But yeah, I mean, in general, the car's in pretty good nick. Like inside, there's obviously the usual kind of marks and things Not you'd expect seats. from an old car. But you know, yeah, <laughs> the seats in there. Go to the back, same sort of thing. It's not bad, um, but yeah. So join us in the next episode where we <laughs> hate ourselves. <laughs> where we camp on a budget yes. and um, regret doing that. Exactly, so. Can't wait. Good luck to us. <laughs>